Alright, hey guys, what's up? Uh, CJ from Hunt Time Adventures here. Uh, I'm going to be showing you how to disassemble and reassemble the Mossberg Maverick 88. Um, got my new fore end, put it all on, so I figured I'd show you a video now. Uh, the first step is make sure that it's clear and uh, that there ain't nothing loaded in it. So just check that, check your, um, you'll be able to feel in the magazine tube if there's anything, which you should know anyways, but just check. And then you'll want to take off your barrel, which you uh, just unscrew this right there. And it's easy, it takes two seconds to do once that's done. Your barrel pops off. Uh, this is a 28 barrel, 28 inch barrel with a mod choke. Uh, set that over to the side. And then from here, it's grab yourself something to use as a little punch. Uh, screwdrivers work, or if you have a punch set. And there is a little pin. This little pin right there. You can see it's got the uh, indent in it, and it has that on both sides, so you can uh, punch it out from either side you want. Just take it, poke that through, and it's not pressed in there, it'll come out easy. Uh, that's the pin, it can go in either way, come out either way, and then from there, you want to lift it, your uh, trigger assembly out from the back or near the uh, stock first lift up and pull out and uh, your trigger assembly's out and let me flip it around like this what you uh, could do next is you want to bring your forehand forward and your bolt and you got two rods on the side which your ejector rods and loading rods right here on the side so you want to pop them out they uh, just slide right in nice and easy and once you get that on your bolt assembly see if I can get some better lighting let me move this camera down a little bit oh, there we go uh, you can see inside the bolt assembly right there you want to take this slide out like that it just pops right out and then what you can do is uh, pull your feed ramp up slide your bolt out and that's your bolt carrier and you can see how this pops down you just squeeze it right there and it comes right out and that's a simple strip of the uh, Mossberg Maverick 88. So let me see if I can get some better lighting uh, right over here. And then I'll show you how to put it back together. Alright, well I'll uh, try this again. I kept, I jammed my finger in it and I uh, kept messing something up. So uh, third time's charm. What you want to do next is take your loader. Make sure this part is facing towards the bottom of the receiver, and you will see. Flip this around. You see these two holes right there, right where my finger is on each side. And what you want to do is clip the ends into them. And now we'll clip in like so. And then you want to take your forehand, clip that on, or slide it on, I should say. Slide that back. From there, take your bolt assembly. Make sure that this piece right here on top is down so you have the open part uh, facing towards you when you slide it in with your uh, gun upside down. And you want to slide that in the receiver slide that back a little bit and then from there 
it will be take this piece, this flat piece, and with the groove facing up, that's how you want to push, put it in. Right here, you can see where it's milled out a little bit more than anywhere else. And uh, you use that to drop this in. Sometimes it is a little bit of a pain if you don't get it perfect. And what you want to do is it's going to hook in to the bottom of your bolt. That's why uh, the hooker is on there. And then there's two little grooves that are milled out of that slide that hooks onto your forend to uh, use the uh, action. And then from there, what you're going to want to do is slide that all the way up into the loaded position and if it's not going for you um, then just push down on that slide a little bit with your finger as you're slowly pulling the forehand up and what you have next is your extractors the one with the pin sticking out on it right there you can see that pin sticking out um, that will go onto the side with the um, ejection port and you'll see a little hole for that to go in right there and then you take the other one and this one does not have um, a pin to hook on it just simply goes in and uh, I'll slide into place and what you do from there is take your trigger assembly and make sure you're putting it in the right way and you want to slide the front in first and if it's not going in you're going to have to uh, just play with those little rods that I was just talking about. Because they'll pop out of place. Sometimes it's a pain to do. Like that one just popped out of place. This one is not staying in. Sometimes if you tip it on the side, I find it helps. Or just use something to push it in with. It's all just a matter of getting it to uh, stay in so you can. There we go. Oh. And that fell out again. Uh, sometimes you get lucky, and this will work right away. And then other times, it will be a pain. fell out also make sure that your four ends all the way up if you have to hold that with one hand and then pop that into place things are a uh, hassle. The more you take it apart, the better you get. Like, see, I got that in now. Then what you want to do is take that pin they popped out and push it back in. Just, you can use a hand or you can use a rubber mallet, whatever. And then from there, you want to take your barrel and throw your barrel back on. which you need to have this compressed so you need to 
open the chamber like that and then your barrel slides on and from there you just tighten this uh, nut on the end do not use pliers or anything you're supposed to just use keep this hand tight and then that is how you uh, disassemble and reassemble a Mossberg Maverick 88 just throw in a uh, function check see how it works and then uh, go take it to the range or the woods and uh, test it out so seems to be working pretty good to me and uh, I'm happy with that I'm gonna have to take it out to the woods just double check everything but uh, 